What's up guys, my name's Timbo and welcome back to another video. Uh, in this one, I have a special announcement for each and every single one of you. If you are a fan of this channel, I'm assuming that you guys like video games, at least to some extent. Over the past, man, maybe a year or so, uh, I've been exploring different things that you guys know um, that I'm currently in college, heading into my senior year, and yeah, I've been trying to figure out what I want to do uh, post-college. So long story short, obviously um, the second semester of my junior year uh, went completely online, and I was sitting there at home, and I was like, what the frick do I do with my time? So I decided to get myself a Skillshare account and learn a little bit about making video games, actually. In a, a video I made a couple months ago, I actually mentioned, uh, like a, showed a little snippet of a video game that I was working on creating um, before my whole entire computer crashed and wiped my hard drive and everything, so that was all lost to time. Uh, but what I did since then, which is pretty exciting, is I've learned enough about game design to actually, this is surprising to even myself, is to teach it. So over the past month, you notice I probably went a month without uploading videos. I went and I've been working on a class where I teach just some very basic game design. And there's a couple places that you guys can view those videos and watch them and learn about game design yourself. The class is taught using Unreal Engine 4. Uh, which I'm assuming a lot of you guys have probably heard of or at least seen before. The Unreal Engine is free to download, so anybody can download it, everybody, anybody can use it. Uh, so that's what I use to teach the class. The whole thing is centered around making your own kind of third-person action-adventure game in kind of the different, uh, like, templates and, and different, um, I guess, little assets uh, to use. So I'm going to go into more detail about what's in the class later in the video, but that's kind of generally speaking. It's centered around the theme of Uncharted. That's kind of the template, like the sound effects and the UI and different arts, different things that we uh, use. Uh, but you can use your knowledge from the class to create such a wide variety of stuff. And like I said, it's for complete beginners. You can take the class never having used Unreal Engine 4 before without any programming knowledge, without any game design knowledge, anything. It's completely for beginner. You sit at home, have no idea what to do, you can take this class and you will learn a lot from it. So right now you're probably asking yourself, Timbo, how the frick do I get access to this dang class that you teach? Well, I'm glad you asked, because there's two ways. Uh, the first way to do it is if you have a uh, Skillshare premium account already set up, meaning that you, uh, wow, I don't really know how else to phrase that. <laughs> you have a Skillshare account and you pay for it, like you pay to be on Skillshare and watch Skillshare classes. You can find the class on Skillshare. Um, there'll be a link in the description to follow where you can find it. Um, and so that is one way that you can watch the class. The other way to access it is going to be more cost effective if you don't already have a Skillshare account. And that is going through Developer University, which is a brand new website. Um, Developer University has other classes on it other than just my own in game design using Unreal Engine 4. Um, those are the classes that I actually originally took that taught me everything that I know, uh, so you know that they're going to be good as well. Developer University works different from Skillshare, meaning that instead of it being a subscription-based thing, um, the costs of the classes are up front. So I believe mine is maybe about $6. It's really about like the cost of a, a cup of coffee. Maybe not like your black cup of coffee, but like a, one of those fancy ones with the dang whipped cream and sprinkles on it. That's how much it costs. The class has 15 videos in it. It would probably take you roughly like two hours or so to watch all the videos. And typically why it was created and also why Developer University, uh, just the whole website was created, was that specifically for people like me, but just for anybody, I mean, game design is such a growing field. And it's a field where Unreal Engine and all these things are like the premier AAA engine and all that is free. And so I think for me, like growing up, I, I wanted to do something creative. And obviously I, I had YouTube at a certain point, but I didn't really know like what I wanted to do with it. Um, and the in, like the to get into actual game design was like so confusing and so weird. And I didn't know if I liked it or whatever. So the great thing about like classes like these is that instead of going to a university, dedicating your time and like thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars, literally, of student loans and debt and money and all this stuff, you can go 
And you can go to a website like Developer University and you can spend 10 bucks or not even that and you can start using these tools. You can learn all this stuff on your own. I mean, it, there really is no downside to it at all. If you went to a university for game design, took some classes and realized you didn't like it, you now may be like $40,000 you owe to this dang school. Developer University, if you take one of the classes and you don't like it, wow, you wasted $10. So by comparison, that's absolutely nothing. It's like no risk, no, no risk, great reward. On top of that, game design companies these days don't require you, and a lot of companies these days don't require you to get a college degree. So I'm actually in college, I'm gonna get a, a bachelor's degree, um, not in game design. So like, yeah, there is value to it. I'm not saying like, don't go to college necessarily. If you wanna learn these things, you can do that without college. So, you know, you can be somebody who is like me, maybe uh, you're gonna enter not into college, you don't really know what you're, you wanna do. You know, with COVID raw at home, you have so much free time. You can go learn this and, and see if you like it, at least, before you go commit to a certain school. You can also be an older person in your 30s, 40s, 50s, or whatever, or even younger, you know, in your teens or something, and just want to learn a new skill or have fun, you know, understand video games, how they work and function, and how people make them. You can appreciate them a lot more, uh, and you can work on your own projects. So there's just so much value um, in it, whether you are somebody who is exploring to do this as a career potentially, or you're just trying to learn a new skill, or you're just trying to kill time. I mean, it's, it's, it's a super quick way. Um, like I said, I mean, just the whole website of Skillshare, not even just game design stuff, you can learn so much stuff on there uh, outside of my class. But specifically with uh, Developer University, you can learn game design stuff using Unreal Engine 4, taking my class, taking the other classes on there. I mean, for me personally, it has been such a great value. If I didn't take those classes, and learn a little bit about game design, I would have absolutely, like, I would, I have no idea what the heck I'm supposed to be doing with my life right now. And I still don't really know what I'm doing with my life right now, but at least I have a little bit more knowledge about if I went into game design or I tried it, I would know if I, you know, liked it or not, or if I'd be good at it. And on top of that, I now actually know how these computer programs work and I can start building my own stuff. And so it's fun just to mess around in it, just just for fun, just for killing time, but it's also cool to be able to do it, to make something that functions, to make something that, you know, your friends can play and people enjoy and things like that. I know I'm going on a long tangent right now, but just do it. Just freaking do it. You would not regret it. So like I said, if you want to check out my class, specifically the one that I teach, 15 videos long, a couple hours, uh, just a few bucks, you get access to all the videos on developeruniversity.com. Otherwise, if you have a Skillshare premium account, you can just search it up and you can find it there. I'll link, I'll leave links to both of them. Um, the only thing is like, if you don't have a Skillshare account, I'm pretty sure Skillshare per month is like, uh, it can be as little as like $9 if you uh, pay for the whole year, but otherwise it's like $19. So it, it would be cheaper, more cost effective of you to just buy the class up front. It's kind of why uh, Developer University works that way. So there aren't like hidden fees or you aren't like continually being continually being charged for like subscriptions. Um, so it's all up front. It's all on your face. You know what you're getting. And uh, yeah, I think that's all I really got to say about it. So with all that out of the way, I made a course trailer that you'll see uh, on both of those websites where you can find the class. And I'm gonna play that now. So you guys have a little bit better understanding of what you'll be taught, what we'll be doing and, and different things. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video and, and considering um, partaking in this course. I would absolutely love to like see some of you guys from YouTube go and, and explore this different outlet to kill some time or to learn some things. Um, I mean, being able to potentially help some of you out that might be around my age in my shoes to navigate maybe what you want to do with a career or different things like that. I mean, that is just, it's really cool. So uh, make sure to leave your comments down in, in the comment section. Uh, and also, I mean, leave reviews, or I would love to see on Skillshare, on Developer University, different things like you came from YouTube and, and you know, blah, 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 things like that. That would be really awesome to see. So I'm going to stop rambling now, and uh, I'm going to play that trailer. So thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you in one of my Unreal Engine 4 classes. These days, video games come in all shapes and sizes. Third person action adventure, first person RPG, choose your own adventure, 
open world, linear, and whatever genre this is. Despite this, all video games share the same principles. Dialogue, music, text and titles, artificial intelligence, interactable objects, the list goes on and on. What if I told you there was one easy tool to help you do all of that and more? And in just a few hours, you could go from knowing nothing about game design to being equipped with the knowledge to start building your own professional looking levels. Hi, my name's Tim, or some of you may know me better as Timbo from my gaming YouTube channel with over 100,000 subscribers. In this course, I'm going to be walking you through step by step how to utilize box collisions, a staple of basic game design. We're going to be building and scripting our own Uncharted-like collectibles from scratch, adding music and dialogue to our game, getting creative with fun animated titles, creating ourselves a friendly AI companion to join us on our journey, and even adding in a dynamic jumping sound system mimicking Nathan Drake himself. And best of all, all assets used in this course are completely free, as we'll be using Unreal Engine 4, the same engine AAA game development studios use to make these popular games. So if you've never opened up Unreal Engine 4 before, or you have in the past and have struggled a little bit, follow me and I'll show you how to start creating your own awesome game using Unreal Engine 4.